This is part two of my video series of traveling trim healthy mama style, traveling eating healthy, traveling eating healthy on a budget, traveling feeding a family. And so um, part one focused on snacks, maybe for on the road or even once you're there. This part is focusing on maybe you have food restrictions, maybe like me, you're gluten free or dairy free or dairy sensitive. So this video specifically is gonna give you some ideas once you're at your location of some quick and easy um, recipes or food that you can make. And so we're gonna dive right in. So we're gonna be staying at my brother and sister-in-law's and I will eat whatever is there whenever I can, but just to not wreak havoc on my system. Again, it's sensitive, um, very intolerant of gluten and sensitive to dairy. I have these things with me and available to suffice if need be. Um, I will often eat maybe the meat or veggies that are there and then um, but I have these other options available. I have my instant oatmeal packs and um, I can link that video below if you're interested. I also probably will be making um, Pearl's apple cinnamon muffins. I plan to have either the oatmeal or the muffins and then my um, hot cocoa mix with protein in it. I can link that video below also if you're interested for breakfasts and then um, just some other things just in case. These are quick and easy um, to transport or what have you, just some simple green beans um, and then the palm, palm mini or however you pronounce it. Um, and then some quick just proteins if I need it, um, some Italian uh, sauce and you could even do like a spaghetti or putting some almond milk with this and making it like a soup. Some tomato soup and then I have they're not so pretty because I froze them but Brianna Thomas's um, fuel pool cornbread I made them into muffins so they're uh, ready to go if I need to supplement again I'm keeping them frozen um, and then another just for a dessert option I'm really enjoying in the trim healthy future um, they are the mint chocolate cupcakes and I just love them and they are fuel pool um, so I individually, I put them in two, um, and I like to just eat them with maybe some milk or what have you poured over them. Super delicious. And then I also have the date night cookie um, to where I can just put it in a bowl, put a little bit of coconut oil and water, and stick it in the microwave, and I have a dessert. And um, I also have some of my instant smoothie packets, the chocolate peanut butter. Um, I can link that video below if you're interested. Um, again, because I will have a blender there. And I might I might just bring some of my staples as well, the, the glue C and pure Sevia, whatever, um, to maybe make a quick pudding if need be. Um, it's also something that's kind of soothing to the gut um, as necessary. And so those are some of my options for while we're there. I also really want to focus on staying hydrated in addition to um, the other things I already showed you, I forgot tea. These are just some of my current favorites that I'm gonna be bringing with me. Um, it's just good. It helps me when I just wanna keep eating um, is to maybe have a cup of tea, but also I'm nursing and so I know that I really need to stay hydrated. So I just wanted to show some of my favorites here real quick. Um, just the oolong green tea with elderberry, especially and vitamin C while traveling. Again, just boosting the immune system and then just helping with inflammation um, and boosting your immune system and digestion, the ginger and the turmeric in particular. Mm -hmm. 